And a great look there at the magically restored polo grounds in Upper Manhattan as MLB The Show is proud to welcome you back to this special edition of Major League Baseball. Coming up, a couple of teams that used to be separated by about a half a mile in New York City, but now they're on opposite coasts in opposite leagues, as it'll be the New York Yankees taking on the San Francisco Giants. Hello again, everybody. Matt Vaskirshen here to take you through this one. With me, as always, are former big leaguers Dave Campbell and Rex Hudler. And, Soup, you've been at this for a long time now. What catches your eye when we look at a matchup like this? Well, one guy that will make his presence felt one way or the other is Mark Teixeira. I mean, here's a guy that's already put together a number of monster seasons, and here's the scary part. He's only just now coming into the prime of his career. He's got to be a serious MVP contender in the years to come. All right, Dave, thanks. We'll hear from Rex in a minute, but first, State Farm shows us the starting lineup for the defending World Series champion New York Yankees. At home or away, State Farm is there. They'll match up against the guy they call the freak, two-time National League Cy Young Award winner, the right-hander Tim Lincecum. Quickly a look now at the defensive alignment they'll face in this one. Set to go now as Curtis Granderson is into the box to get this one underway. Underway here this afternoon as the first pitch is sliced on the ground to third. On to first, and that'll take care of Granderson for the game's first out. Swing and a high chopper. And the throw is not good. The zone. Swing and a ground ball towards the middle. And, oh, that looked like it caught him squarely in the arm. And he still has the wherewithal to get the out at first, but now we'll have to see if he's all right. So you think you want to be a pitcher? Look at the shot he takes here in show motion. Oh, and he's going to stay in the game after that? He's a gamer. Lead off here. Late on the changeup, but he's still able to get a lot of this one out toward deep right field. And this ball is gone. So a two-run shot for Derek Jeter. And this is now a two-to-nothing lead for the Yankees. Hmm. Strike away from working out of the inning and stranding a guy in scoring position. But this ball's sitting on a tee and he drives it right over the wall. Now a ball crushed high in the air, deep to left, way back there. And that one is long gone. So it's a solo home run for Freddy Sanchez. And the Giants have struck for a run. It's now a two to one ball game. So he's trying to do a full loop to the lineup here. But this guy's got other ideas. That'll snap you back to reality in a hurry. In two strikes. And look how calm he looks out there. His tempo looks really good right now. Now a ball lined toward right center. And this is going to find the gap for Posada. Should be extra bases. Well, he is in there with a triple. Whoa. Well, you don't see too many catchers legging out triples. Way to go, big fella. If you're going to try to get that guy to fish for a curveball down there, you better make sure you can keep it in front of you. And a big RBI there as the run scores to make this a two-run game now. now. Check this out again. Good job of keeping his head on the ball all the way. And that drives home a run to make this out number two. Freddie Sanchez will stand in again as we take it back to earlier in the ball game. This one swing here has been the entire offense to this point as this home run accounted for the only run they've tallied so far. Chance 
and gone for a home run. So a solo shot down the line and left. His second home run of the game. And the Giants are back within a run at 3-2 now. Oh, it came in this ninth inning with a two-run lead. So he had a mulligan to work with. That mulligan's gone now, so he'll need to bear down right here if he wants to close this one out. And Joe Girardi is going to get up off the dugout bench and confer at home plate, so we'll likely see a double switch here. I've got to be saying, thank goodness we don't have to deal with Sabathia anymore. Ah, and he strikes him out to end it here as they were able to get the possible time run to the plate but could not cash in. Well, as far as saves go, they don't come a whole lot easier than that. He comes on and throws three pitches, and it's shake hands with your catcher time. He'll take it. Definitely treated to a Cy Young style performance from the Cy Young Award winning left hander CC Sabathia. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, Matt, he couldn't get that final out in the ninth, but still, eight and two thirds good innings, and he was on his game here in this one. So that'll just about wrap things up. For Dave and Rex, I'm Matt. As always, this has been a presentation of MLB 10 The Show. For more, surf on over to MLB10TheShow.com. The Yankees come out on top. Three to two. We'll leave you with some of the highlights from our ball game as we say so long, everybody.